Hi everybody, I want to welcome you to your Tabata pump workout for today. What we need is a barbell, but if you don't have the right barbell at your disposal, you can use a pair of dumbbells for this workout as well. Now we're going to follow Tabata's method of exercise by creating a short circuit of eight exercises with only 10 seconds rest in between. I hope you guys enjoy this workout. Let's get into it with exercise one. Bench press with a nice wide grip and your lower back pressing into the bench for support. Skull crusher all the way to the top of your head, keeping your elbows as static as you can. Barbell pullover with soft straight arms and 90 degrees of motion. Seated with a neutral spine and sturdy legs, we're going to shoulder press with a reverse grip. Bent over row with your palms facing forward, elbows tucked in and neutral spine. Biceps curl into front raise, keeping a static upper body and engaging your core. Upright row straight up, leading with your elbows and protecting your wrists.
spider biceps curl by pressing your elbows into your knees and getting good range of curl motion. Alright guys, you've gotten through the first round and discovered your eight exercises for today. We've got three more rounds to go. Let's do this. Bench press with a nice wide grip and your lower back pressing into the bench for support. Skull crusher all the way to the top of your head, keeping your elbows as static as you can. Barbell pullover with soft straight arms and 90 degrees of motion. Seated with a neutral spine and sturdy legs, we're going to shoulder press with a reverse grip. Bent over row with your palms facing forward, elbows tucked in and neutral spine. Biceps curl into front raise, keeping a static upper body and engaging your core.
upright row straight up, leading with your elbows and protecting your wrists. Spider biceps curl by pressing your elbows into your knees and getting good range of curl motion. Two rounds down and two rounds to go guys. Let's keep up the good work and let's keep training. Bench press with a nice wide grip and your lower back pressing into the bench for support. Skull crusher all the way to the top of your head, keeping your elbows as static as you can. Barbell pullover with soft straight arms and 90 degrees of motion. Seated with a neutral spine and sturdy legs, we're going to shoulder press with a reverse grip. Bent over row with your palms facing forward, elbows tucked in and neutral spine.
biceps curl into front raise, keeping a static upper body and engaging your core. Upright row straight up, leading with your elbows and protecting your wrists. Spider biceps curl by pressing your elbows into your knees and getting good range of curl motion. You're smashing your workout guys, three rounds down, we got one more to go, let's keep going. Bench press with a nice wide grip and your lower back pressing into the bench for support. Skull crusher all the way to the top of your head, keeping your elbows as static as you can. Barbell pullover with soft straight arms and 90 degrees of motion. Seated with a neutral spine and sturdy legs, we're going to shoulder press with a reverse grip.
bent over row with your palms facing forward, elbows tucked in and neutral spine. Biceps curl into front raise, keeping a static upper body and engaging your core. Upright row straight up, leading with your elbows and protecting your wrists. Spider biceps curl by pressing your elbows into your knees and getting good range of curl motion. Well done for getting through your Tabata workout for today, you guys. Now I'm going to hand things over to Daphne, who's going to work on some static post-workout stretching with you. Stand facing a wall. Reach your right arm up and place the palm on the wall above shoulder height. Draw your right shoulder down and press your shoulder into the wall whilst rotating the upper body to the left. Take three to five slow breaths and try to deepen the stretch with rotating the upper body even more with each exhale. Let's repeat the standing chest stretch on the left side. Take one arm and extend it across your body. Keeping the arm straight, gently pull your extended arm from above your elbow to deepen the stretch. Remember to draw the shoulders down away from your ears.
Now let's do the posterior shoulder stretch using the other arm. Bring both arms in front of you and wrap your hands around the back of your ribcage. Ground your upper back and bring your chin towards your chest. Now inch your fingers towards the spine to increase the intensity of the stretch. Breathe deeply and hold for five breaths. Raise one arm straight above you, bend your elbow so that your forearm is behind your head and reach your fingertips down your spine. Using your opposite hand, gently pull your bent elbow toward midline. Keep your shoulders relaxed and away from your ears. Now let's do the standing tricep stretch on the other side. Raise your arms straight above you and clasp your hands together with your right thumb on top. Reach your hands as tall as you can and bend your body over to the left. You should feel a stretch along the right side of your body. Remember to keep your shoulders down and your abdominals engaged to support your spine. Repeat on the other side with your left thumb on top, bending over to the right side. Great job, well done for finishing your workout today. Now guys, make sure you click here and subscribe to this channel so that you can get more workouts anytime you like. If you hit the join icon and join us as a member, then you'll get access to days 11 to 30 of every workout series as well. See you soon.